In this tutorial we will learn how to use the Ciduino Xiao with the Compass I2C sensor QMC5883 and the OLED display. We will display all the axis and the temperature on the display. Of course this is just a demo, you can modify the project according to your needs. For this project you will need a Compass QMC5883, GY271 sensor, OLED display, Ciduino Xiao, breadboard, jumper wires and Visuino program. Wire everything according to this schematic. Go to visuino.eu and download and install Visuino software. Start Visuino and select the Arduino board, in our case, it's Ciduino Xiao board. Add, Compass QMC5883, GY271, component. Add, OLED I2C display component. Double click on the, display OLED 1, and in the, elements, window, add 4, draw text, elements, to the left side, and add 4, text field, elements to the left side. In the, elements window, select, draw text 1, and in the properties window set, text, to X. In the, elements window, select, draw text 2, and in the properties window set, text, to Y, and Y to 20. In the, elements window, select, draw text 3, and in the properties window set, text, to Z, and Y to 40. In the, Elements window, select, draw text 4, and in the Properties window set, text, to temp and Y to 55. In the, Elements window, select, text field 1, and in the Properties window set X to 20. In the, Elements window, select, text field 2 and in the properties window set X to 20 and Y to 20. In the elements window, select text field 3, and in the properties window set X to 20 and Y to 40. In the elements window, select text field 4, and in the properties window set X to 50 and Y to 55. Close the elements window. Connect compass 1 pin x to display oled 1 pin text field 1 in connect compass 1 pin y to display oled 1 pin text field 2 in connect compass 1 pin z to display oled 1 pin text field 3 in connect compass 1 pin thermometer to display oled 1 pin text field 4 in connect compass 1 pin i2c out to shall board pin i2c in connect display oled 1 pin i2c out to shall board pin i2c in on the bottom click on the build tab make sure you selected the right board and port and click on the compile build and upload button